Booya! It's your girl Booya and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, your girl will be trying out and reviewing Lipinas' newest release, yung Kislap Liquid Highlighter nila. And tingnan natin if maganda ba yung performance nila and if worth it to invest yung pera ni dito. Now, let's proceed to the swatch. So, I just want to show you guys yung swatch niya on my arms. So, yan po yung itsura niya. By the way, it doesn't mean na ganun yung itsura niya sa arms ko. Ganun din yung effect niya sa aking face. So, by the way, before we proceed on trying out the highlighters, if you have any questions for me, then don't be shy to message me on my Instagram account. It's at Makeup by Buya. My DM is open 24-7 for any beauty questions that you have for me. Also, meron tayong Facebook group, guys. So, if you want to be a part of the Boo Fam or the Boo Hive, you absolutely can. Can, just click the link down in the description box below. In that Facebook group, you can share memes, ask beauty questions, and share your beauty tips, and be friends with like-minded people. So if you want to be a part of that, just click the link down in the description box below. But make sure you answer the group questions completely because I decline those people who try to enter the group but do not answer the group questions or naga answer lang pero hindi kino complete. So kailangan complete, guys, para malam ko na you really want to engage sa group natin. So the first shade that I'm gonna be trying out is the shade Marcella. So at yung gold nila na shade. And what I'm gonna do guys for all the highlighters is dito ko lang i-apply sa high point na aking face. Only on this part lang, hindi na sa rest ng face ko kasi try on lang naman eh. Tingnan natin kung alin sa tatlo yung pinaka mabibet ko. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just um gonna apply it directly. And hopefully, this is gonna give like a golden. And I'm just blending it out with my finger. So what I noticed about the performance of this highlighter, I pwede siyang subtle na glow or pwede din siyang blinding glow. So pwede mo siyang i-build up, guys. Napaka-buildable ng highlighter na to. Although, what I noticed is that pag Diba may pigment siya sa loob ng component. But once you blend it out, nawawala yung pagka-gold niya. Oo, nawawala siya. For some reason, wala na siya. Parang, parang naging puting highlighter na lang siya. Hindi siya kagaya, for example, ng EB na highlighter na kita mo gold siya. Pero pag in mo sa face mo, gold pa rin siya. Or yung Sunny's face na glow boss na pag in mo sa face mo, tsaka pag binlend mo, yung glow boss ay kung ano yung pigment niya, nandyan pa rin siya. Eto, pag binlend out mo siya, nawawala yung yellowish or goldish color niya, which it should have had. Kasi if puro highlight lang na glow lang, parang pinatong lang siya on our skin. Pero if may pigment siya, mas parang yung highlighter nagiging ano siya nagiging one with the skin kaya when you see other highlighters na parang nagbe-melt sa skin or parang glow from within siya it's because the pigment is similar sa skin color natin which is yan dapat yung purpose of having a gold highlighter pero for some reason this one nawawala yung pagka gold niya and now let's proceed on the second shade which is Delfina ito yung rose gold nila na shade directly oh okay Nasaan na yung rose gold? Sizz! Nawala siya. And I'm just gonna... Okay. Nawawala talaga yung pigment, guys. As in... You know, this is actually the second time that I'm filming this review. And nawawala talaga yung pigment. Okay, ganun pa rin yung thoughts ko. Kasi nung first time ko tong tinry out yung highlighters, ganun yung experience ko, nawala. Nawawala yung pigment. And ganun din dito. Nawawala talaga siya. Parang, parang walang, ano, walang nagagawa yung colors. Kasi when you blend it out, hindi mo nakikita na, oh, may distinct difference yung gold. May, di may difference pag yung rose gold. Wala, guys. Alam nga naman hindi nyo i-blend out. So, ayan. Parang nagiging white siya. Alam niyo yung white highlighters. Parang ganun siya. Parang nakapatong na highlighter. Parang ganun yung effect niya. Ayan. Tapos when you blend it out, wala. Nawawala yung pigment. Naiwan na lang yung shimmer. 
Ganun siya. So the final shade that I'm gonna be trying out is Lorenza. So ito yung pearl nila na shade. I'm not a big fan of white pearl highlighters kasi it just doesn't work on the Filipina color. Like it just does not work. Or if it does, um, it matches your preference. Pero if you're the typical Filipina chick na pang everyday lang na highlighter, hindi ko to ma-recommend sa inyo kasi napakaputi niya and it will really give this yeah, white cast and it just does not complement with our skin color because it's leaning na on the cool side. Okay. Hmm, natatakot talaga ako sa mga gantong highlighters, guys. It's so white! Huh, it's so white, honey. Hirapan kang ma-blend. Ayan. So, hmm. Hindi talaga ako big fan ng white highlighter. Although, sa totoo lang, if na-blend out siya, parang ganun din siya sa Marcella tsaka sa Delfina. Kasi again, nawawala yung pigment, nawawala yung pagka-gold, nawawala yung pagka-rose gold when you blend it out. So now let's discuss naman their product information. So yung highlighters na to guys ay na-release sila or na-launch sila ng Independence Day ng Pilipinas which was on June 12, 2020. And again, the shades that are available ay tatlo pa lang. So merong Marcella which is yung gold na highlighter, Lorenza which is the rose gold highlighter, and Delfina which is the pearl highlighter. The shade names guys were inspired by the women who sold the first official flag of of the Philippines. And yung fun facts nito actually guys, makikita nyo siya sa box na packaging ng Kislap Liquid Highlighters. Which is amazing to know that we have brands like this na nagpro-produce ng products na you can still learn from or you can still, you know, recall your history. Kasi minsan kasi na kakalimutan natin yung history natin. Super guilty about that. Pero it's nice that we can remember our history through our makeup products and I'm super glad that we have brands like this that help us remember. Yung shelf life ng highlighters guys ay 12 months. Yung net weight niya ay 5 ml. It is paraben and cruelty free, all made from the Philippines. And yung price niya guys ay 199 pesos each. So for 199 pesos tapos 5 ml, uh, madami na ka namang products na makukuha. Although, let's talk about performance first and yung verdict ko sa kanya. Now, let's proceed to my final verdict and recommendations. So, for the Kislap Liquid Highlighters, personally, hindi ko pa siya ma-recommend talaga sa inyo na, oh yan, i-post nyo talaga or I'm really hyped about this product because um, medyo hindi ako satisfied with its performance on my face. Hindi ako satisfied because when you blend out the highlighters, it all has parang a similar outcome. Parang walang nagawa yung different shades of highlighter. Walang nagawa yung pagka-gold na highlighter. Walang nagawa yung pagka-rose gold or yung pearl highlighter. Because when you blend it out, it looks the same. So doon ako na sad kasi yung performance ay hindi siya na-match sa expectation ko. Sana yung shades na in-offer nila ay hindi ganto. Sana they offered shades na mas deep yung pagka-gold. Hindi ko ma-recommend sa inyo na gumamit kayo ng pearl highlighters tsaka rose gold, lalo na pag deep morena ka. Kasi yung itsura nito sa skin ng Filipina ay eh, parang pinatong lang na highlighter. Parang makeup na highlighter. Hindi siya yung glow from within na highlighter. Pero yung maganda naman about this, kasi nakaset actually yung face ko with powder eh. So kahit liquid highlighter siya, hindi siya, hindi niya nare-remove yung foundation ko sa baba. Intact pa rin siya which is good. By the way, yung scent niya is parang gulaman na scent. Isa pang pro ng highlighter na to is napaka-buildable niya. So, pwede siyang subtle glow and pwede din siyang blinding glow. So, that's it for my review of Lipinas' Kislap Liquid Highlighters. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys think. Would you buy it ba or not? 
let me know in the comment section below. Again, if you like this video, then please do give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and share this video. Again, if you have any makeup or beauty questions for me, then don't be shy to message me on my Instagram account. It's at Makeup by Buya. My DM is open 24-7 for any beauty questions that you have for me. Also, guys, if you want to be a part of the Boo fam, you absolutely can. Just click the link down in the description box below and it will lead you to our Facebook group. And just make sure you answer the group question. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any more video requests for me, then don't be shy to enter them down in the comment section below with the hashtag, hashtag request booyah. Again, just remember, no hate, just love.